in uh, the boxing world. We Jake Paul? have Jake Paul and Mike Tyson are going to go at it. Ladies and gentlemen. Listen, listen. This is going to be one of the realest fights ever made. Just chill the hell on out. First of all, let's just get this clear. This is some exhibition shit you go to see. Nope, at- nope, nope. Wait, hold on, hold on. Oh, wait, up, did you, did you, board. are you about to pull out the contract stuff? Because it's ridiculous. Yeah, okay. No. So, is it, if, first of all, wait, wait, if it's it, real, if it's real. I was about to say, is this actually real? We don't know, but okay, so, if, if any of it's real, it's there's no there's, way. There's no, I think it's not real because um the the I don't the believe the, head- the boxing commission from Texas actually came out and debunked a couple of things mm-hmm. and said it said it said a couple of things. So right. one of the fake things that there was on the contract, supposedly fake things on the on the contract, that uh, Mike Tyson has to <laughs> drop his weight to one sixty seven. Uh, also, that uh, Paul awesome. will be wearing uh, fucking Head headgear. Gear. There's and no also, way. and also that Paul can tag in his brother. <laughs> yeah, that one, that one was hysterically funny. <laughs> well, you know, yeah, okay, so this yeah. is the shit that's been going on around the interwebs all fucking right. week. There's Both no of them are getting way, ass bro. Knock the hell on out. This shit is an exhibition match. I don't care. What nobody tells me. There's no way that uh, you know Mike's going in there to risk his legacy against a Jake Paul. Like, it, like, just, there's just no way, bro. And honestly, so, I don't think that he can win anyway. So, so if they're looking, they're look. Uh, the commissioner said this. Uh, the contract looks uh, more like a, a professional boxing match, but they haven't decided which one is going to be. If it's going to be an exhibition or if it's going to be a boxing match, it's that was the real news. And he and he also his comment was stop looking at the stop looking at the internet. <laughs> It's gonna be an exhibition. It's gonna be a Mayweather thing all over again. Like there's no it's shot. Yeah, 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 but Mayweather, Mayweather almost locked out. He knocked out Logan and he like, helped him up. That's what I'm saying. Like it's uh, I, I'm not. Thank God it's on Netflix. I would never pay for something like that again. Yeah, no, never. It's, it's an exhibition. I'm not mad. Make your money. I think they're gonna make you pay for this because uh, ex- um, Netflix has had has you're had. For it. Yeah, they have. They have had uh, three other uh, sporting events on Netflix. I think one was a golfing tournament. The other one was um, a tennis tournament and something. Uh, one other thing, I forgot what it was. I don't know if it was um, cricket. I don't know, but but Netflix is going to start doing all that shit because they're getting WWE too. So they're going to end up doing yeah. all the pay per view shit. They're just going to end up charging you on charging you. Pay for your twenty dollars a month, and then also, oh, you want to watch this pay per view? It's going to run you fucking fifty, seventy, eighty bucks, hundred bucks, whatever the fuck it is. Like it, you know, this is the game they play. They try to get you to spend more money on shit. All right, so watch yeah. party at my house. Sure. I'll I'll sit there and watch that nonsense. Why not? I really a, hope I'm, I'm not DJing, but I feel like I am. I'll, I'll put a, I'll put a bet down. Fucking fucking. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll put, <laughs> no, no, bro. Listen, I'll I'll put I'll put some I'll put some money on Jake, bro. I'll put money on Jake, bro. What the fuck wrong with you? <laughs> You you know that's a, you almost you're about to get your black card taken away because Dude, if it's a, because if it's a real fight, what Mike happened Tyson with Mayweather? Murder him. Yeah, it's that's not the thing even... nobody understands. Mike, that, listen. We were ha- who I think it was the three of us were having a discussion. On <laughs> Mike Tyson at 57 would fucking, I'm not even kidding you, he would murder Jake Paul in cold blood in a straight would, up fucking he fight. Would he actually, would murder him. He would kill him. <laughs> he would literally kill him. Right, and wait, listen, wait, wait, like, 100, wait, wait, 167 pounds. What does Mike Tyson walk around at, do we think? Two, 240, 250? I t- I'll tell you right dude, now. He look, dude, he looks, he looks fucking. Good. I think he's at. I think he's at two. I think he's at two fifteen, two twenty tops. Okay. If, so if he's at two twenty, you're gonna tell me before this fight he has to drop fifty fucking pounds for this fight? Yeah, Maybe that's, potentially. That's what I think. No shot. Right. No, no shot. No <laughs> fucking way. And listen, people. People need to understand something. Mike Tyson has never stopped training. Like two forty ish, two thirty, two forty. Current age, the the actual just muscle memory, the instinct. Of how and when to move is like he is so far beyond Jake Paul, and, and no disrespect to Jake, but no, no disrespect to Jake. No, all this disrespect man, to Jake. I don't know, I don't know, listen, I'm, I'm, I'm not going to say that because I Fake mean, listen, boxer. I expected him out of here a lot earlier, you know. But let's be clear, he is nowhere near a Mike Tyson at this point. Right, I don't, of course and he, not. Tyson and he, and he knows that literally before. I would say, okay, maybe he's got a chance right. in a real match. But but you know what? Here's my thing about it. And listen, I, I'm not going to pretend to know everything about boxing, right? No, but, same. like, if he was, like, dead serious about, like, really competing and contending, like, 
Like, uh, he listen, at the end of the day, I feel like he just wants money at this point. Like, that's what we're doing this for. We're yeah, doing it for funny. money, also, right? Also, like, you know, like, in there with real contenders, really go for the belt. And honestly, for all we know, like, he could go that route and actually do that. But, but Jake Paul did fight a real boxer, Canelo. And he lost, not Canelo. Who did he fight? Uh, the little brother of, uh, what's his name? Fucking oh, hell. Oh, yeah. Uh, God Rafa, wasn't that, wasn't he like really early on? Was that really early on? No, that was like, oh, I don't, I don't like, know. I was really like two not years ago. Attention. He fought, um, he fought a, a fury, a little fury. Oh, okay. Right? Little yeah, fury. He, not, he, yeah, he, and he, and he fucking lost. He fought a real boxer and he lost. Right, so you what know I'm, what happened? What <laughs> like, I'm saying is if he actually put the time and commitment in to actually I mean, fury, really be a boxer you. and go through it, he, dude, he might be, he might be Bro, all right. Like, you there, don't know. There's a, there's a reason why no, you I mean, work maybe. your way up. Yeah. Because at each weight class, it's a different. The hits are different. The punches are different. The way that the, the strategy is different. Not to mention the fact that, you know, what you get hit with at welterweight and what you get hit with at heavyweight is like you like we're 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 here saying that Jake Paul could actually get murdered. But if Mike Tyson hits you in a moment of anger, you're it's gonna knock the spirit out of your body. Yep, that. <laughs> What he said. Did you not see the hangover at all? You, 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 you know that viral video where the dude walks out and kicks dude in the head and it looks like he decapitates him? That would literally happen to Jake Paul with a fist if no. it was real. But the like, thing I'm is, not also, joking when I say that. Also, they did uh, Jake Paul did a promo video telling all his family that he's having this fight. Uh, Logan said, oh yeah, let's go, let's go, let's go. His mother said, uh, are you sure you want to do this? Yeah, his mother <laughs> should have said that. Are you and, sure his father, you and his father said, uh, he asked his father, oh, who's your who's your, your your favorite fighter back then? He was like, Mike Tyson. And he was like, and he was like, oh, I'm fighting Mike Tyson. And his father said, he, he hits like a bitch. You know that, right? And he was, and he was like, yeah, I know. And Jake was like, yeah, I know. And he was like, he hits like a bitch. He hit, he's one of the hardest hitting boxers ever. And he looked at Jake Paul like, "What the fuck are you? You you're gonna die." And also, they had uh, Jake Paul and Tyson had an interview, and you can see Jake uh, Jake Paul's trying to do that little fucking uh, try to sell the fight shit with Mike Tyson, and Mike Tyson got serious. No, he was, Mike Tyson literally said, "What have you done for boxing? I'm in the Hall of Fame." Fair, listen, fair it, and it, true. It, like this, is what people don't understand. I watched Mike Tyson on, I think it was his podcast, and he, and um, he was in an interview, and 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 he, and he was saying how he, he's constantly afraid that he will let the old Mike Tyson out of the body, and how you do that is by a, a, attacking things that are very dear to him. Number one being his legacy, which is his entire identity. So. For you to go out there, like everything's a game, but this is one of your, you ever had one of those friends that you play with and then you hit them wrong and then all of a sudden it's a different world? Like this is Mike Tyson, bro. This is this is the, the wrong hit and the switch comes on and now he's going on straight instinct and you're going to die in the ring, bro. Yeah, I, th yo, I think he gets hit with two jabs and, he, and it clicks on. <laughs> I'm calling it. Wow. Two jabs. Paul hits him with two jabs, and Tyson turns it back into Tyson. Click. Bro, he's 68. <laughs> he's been boxing since he was what, 14, 15 years old. Yeah. Dude, that's yeah. a dangerous and scary man, and not just in the round. I don't know. I don't know if you guys ever seen, and I recommend watching it. Um, the the Mike Tyson and uh, Tony Robbins interview that they had for like an hour yeah. or whatever yeah. it was. Yeah. Dude, the things that guy talks about, you you could feel it on him. He's that terrifying. that is just he's a he's a dangerous man, but like he doesn't want to be that anymore. But like Chase said, you you bring that out of him, he ain't going oh, back. Oh, <laughs> you know where yeah. Until he hears that fucking bell ring, you better have a ain't. bell in his pocket. Like, they, they, they cut this shit out, like, <laughs> he ain't never going back if you bring that guy out. Like no one yeah, wants bro, to see that. that. If that guy comes out, he will knock mm -hmm. out everybody in the damn building. <laughs> yeah, literally everybody. Like, everybody. How people can think about what? Literally, 25, 30, 25 30 literally. people out. What, Yo, what are you? What are you doing here, Lady Gaga? What? It's done. It's over. Yeah. You're either gonna get hit, or you're gonna get your ear bit. <laughs> so, Johnny Fish said, "I hope Mike takes his ear." That would be hilarious. <laughs>
Look what Mike, look what Mike, Mike did to Alan. Alan. <laughs> and hang over. Oh, God. I mean, you don't mess with the man's tiger. You know what I mean? Yeah, like, you get what you get. He still has the fucking thing. 